And the first preseason game for the green and gold brings out thousands of tailgaters. Fans set up everything from food to games in the parking lot of Lambeau Field this afternoon, but others, well, they started a new tradition indoors. NBC 26's Shane Gustafson live with more fans tonight in the new Tailgate Village. And Shane, how are things looking right now? Yeah, John and Cassandra, the tailgate village that you see behind me has been packed pretty much all night here with fans trying to get the Lambo experience without the Lambo cost. Now, before the game, fans filled the parking lot to play games and eat food, but just after kickoff, the 13,000 square foot building was full with fans watching the game on dozens of TVs located inside. The party deck was also full of fans taking in the action and enjoying the night in Green Bay. Some fans say they're not ready to give up the traditional tailgating tradition yet. Others coming from farther away and cheering on the other team said they were excited to take in the experience. Oh, it's great out here. The, the fans out here are, are they're really good fans. Um, so it's, it's actually fun as an opposing team to come to Packer games. So can't beat it really. Now the tailgate village is free for fans all season long. So again, even if you don't go inside the field, you can still come out here and enjoy the experience. And as fans are leaving Lambeau here tonight, a lot of them are telling us that the tailgate village was one of their most memorable experiences of this first preseason game. Keeping you connected in Green Bay and Lambeau Field, Shane Gustafson, NBC 26. All right, Shane, thanks very much. I think the village will be pretty popular once temperatures dip. And